Hello everybody, my name is Stally111 and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. I think it's t part 25 we uh, are jumping into now of uh, Fallout New Vegas with Legion. And I was just uh, looking at this and look how close we were last episode to leveling up. 7xp. So, what I'm gonna do... Oh, they respond. Time for some get even. Ah, bugger. Oh, I'm out. I level up. You gonna hurry up and level up? Right, come on. Come on, Cass. Need to fucking kill this thing before I fucking die. Oh, don't need this right now. Someone's looking to cash their chips early. Oh, of course. Well, um, yeah. So we need seven XP, and we always leveled up there. Let's uh, just level up again, and um, not waste any ammo. Eh, screw it. Do we have any doctor's bag? Right. So can we can we can we go? Yes, we can. Right. So where I'm going to go this episode? It's going to finish uh, that lucky old son. Oh no, <laughs> we're going to have to kill these bastards, aren't we? We are. Are you? That how you want to play, huh? You take them on, you take the hits. Shh. We're hunting shitheads. Oh, here we go. Alright, repair. No, we're not gonna have enough. No. Bastard. We're not gonna have enough. Bloody hell. Have to get another two thousand XP. <sighs> Jesus. All right, I've got a plan. Right, sorry about that. My plan is to get the alien blaster, and then we're gonna jump into something. Um, somewhat a quest. Oh, hello. Let's paint this place. Jesus, we are low in ammunition on the hunting rifle. We must use quite a lot. Um, we need a lot of ammo. Twelve XP. Any XP is fine by me. You're dead. No. I like how he is just standing there while his uh, whole posse are getting destroyed. So, there's, if you guys have never played this game and you're, this is like a, a walkthrough as such for you, Alien Blaster time. If you want to find the Alien Blaster, we are just about to find it. Um, it is, I believe, the, or one of the most powerful weapons in the game. It is one, it is one of them. But I do not recommend you use it as a common occurrence because it is very limited to the ammunition it's only the ammunition that you get um which you'll see me getting that you can get unless you use console commands which i am not because i want to i've used console commands and mods and such so much um in let's plays and i've forgotten about them like i've done a little thing on youtube that i'm flying about or something like that um that i've just forgotten about it and ended up having no achievements or anything. I played like a hundred plus hours uh, on PC on, on Xbox. I played way more, but got 150 hours or something on PC on Steam, and I've got like n hardly any achievements because I've used some sort of console command. Um, because console commands make make the game a lot more fun at times. Um, so the mods, mods are the big thing that. 
I'm surprised how little I've actually played a Fallout with mods. Um, Alright, so what you're looking for... Oh, yes. um, we have to uh, make sure that we do have Wild Wasteland. You need to have Wild Wasteland to see this. Because crazy things do happen and... Uh, I'm not sure if that's supposed to be an alien thing up there. Because it looks odd. And it's around about here that... No, oh, that's just a tree, I think. Yeah, my bad. Anyway. It is nearby here that... Um, I think we passed it. Yeah, the canyon wreck... The uh, northern passage. Not the canyon wreckage. The canyon wreckage is over here. I think it's that far. No, no, no. Canyon wreckage is... Yeah, it is. There's a location there, but canyon wreckage is here. That's for uh, another... Um, DLC. Here we go. There's an alien spaceship. There is uh, three aliens there. We're going to kill them for their weapon. Oh, oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm, yeah, I'm dead. See how powerful they are. So, I'm going to try and kill them at a distance. Oh, or I could fire and like cast go in, weaken them. Oh bugger, I'm gonna have to travel all that, I'm not. We're back over here. And um, we've only got three. Bugger. Right. Let's go. Eh. I want to stop recording here and I am going to return when I'm near there. Right, so we are back and um, that's up there the, the crazy thing that I thought was a alien thing as a, of sorts. So it's just over here hill. And I have saved this time. You better be ready for the fight your life, Cass. Because Alien Blaster is one of the most... I think it is um, the most powerful energy weapon. I think it's only seconded... No, not seconded. Oh, hello. I'm here already. Um, it's not as good as... Keeping quiet. Uh, I think it's the... Oh... I think it's O Baby, the Super Sledge, the uh, unique Super Sledge. Aliens are, uh, it's the alien captain who has one that you can pick up. Here they come. Take out the alien captain. Right, he's down. One of them's down. You're up, Cass. Serving up some hurt. Gonna six this bitch. Right, one of them's dead. Uh, just got one more crew member left. Cass, you're not gonna get them like that. Oh, you are actually. Ow! 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 That hurted me. Right, so let's go in and loot their bodies. Alien. Got that. Oh. I don't recall them having all of that. Oh, oh yeah, that's from Old War. No, it's not. I don't, I don't remember them having all these weapons. Captain Sidearm. 127. 68. Ah, who cares? Let's have a little look-see. We've got quite a few alien things there. Alien Atomizer, which damage is 38. Blaster, 68. Disintegrator is 
68-2. Those two are going to be useful. In Captain Sidearm. Is, I think it is fairly similar to... Yeah, I think it is pretty much the same as um, Alien Blaster f for looks. Um, hmm. Let's have a little look. And I think there's a slight difference. Let's have a little, another look. See, Captain Sidearm. I think it's slightly different. Yeah, it's white, and the Alien Blaster is blue. Um, how much damage is it again? Oh, don't want to do that. It's console commands. Come on. 8.2 times 6. Mm, it's like 49 or something. Yeah. Four. Yeah, I think it is 49. Right. We need to use the doctor back. Because we have a crippled head and... You know what? We do need to use... that. Let's have a little peek see at this. It doesn't have any iron sights, but it could be useful for fights. I, I didn't realise how... Oh yeah, it's different. P-module. P-modules and Captain Sidearm. P-module. So the alien blasters, alien power cells. That is unlimited supply. That's the best damaging weapon. There's this with 68. I know it's the same. That was 68 before. Don't know how it changed. Oh well. Um, alien blaster. We've got it. Alien guns. Um, we should probably save. That would be useful. Nice we save. Just in case something bad happens to us. I know I'm just about to fast travel, which kind of neglects the point. But we are going to Helios 1. And we're going to see if we can complete Sunshine Boogie. I think that was l l Repair 25 um, that we saw in that, that thingy, my Bob Rick. Uh, you can. Caravan okay. of two now. I'm just checking my timer. Sorry, I've stopped a couple of times in this. I do have my washing machine on. And I'm hoping that it doesn't go really loud. I'm actually hoping it's actually working. It doesn't sound like it is. Uh, let's go this way. Because we just like we just got a new washing machine. The fir the fir like the one before that, like it wasn't spinning anymore. So we just got this one, and it is a second-hand one. Because, like, it was really, really cheap, and yeah, why not? So we hope it's working. We we did it. We had a little look, and we tried it first. Um, it was working. We tried it here just to clean it up, and it's working. But it was really squeaky. So I'm worried because I can't hear it. Oh yeah, there is mole rats or something that uh, come after you once you've. Like, if you're not good with the NCR, please be working. Yes! Savage! Got one. Who knows which side the Legion's gonna hit us from next. Let's go on the, the quest Sunshine Boogie. And get all these. I think, I hope, I hope they're all level 20 needed. Because then we can get that, get that quest done and get ourselves up to 36 at least might give ourselves a maybe go try and get up to 40 because it is 35 we need to repair that generator and inside we've got claustrophobia which uh, puts it down by one which is a bugger but uh, I think it puts it down by one. It could put it a bit down by more. It could be a percentage. But it was putting it down by one before. Salvage. Uh, 
right, actually, world map. Let us... Alright. Go back to... Oh, can't go there. I thought I unlocked that position when we did the ants misbehaving. And not that mission, that um, location. Turns out we didn't. Oh, well. So try and get Sunshine Boogie done. Uh, I'd like to get Helios ones, uh, that uh, Lucky Old Sun done as well this episode. Um, but I don't want to stretch it out in case my uh, washing machine turns out just turns to go squeaky again, go really loud. Because I, I did test, I was going to do this video earlier, but my microphone was picking up the squeak. It was very faint, but I'd rather just my fan, because that's still annoying me. That it, it picks up in the videos, which I'm trying to put a little bit of music over. And I can't put music in the game up for the radio or anything because copyright is a bugger. And I don't want to put the same old, same old music on every single episode. And it's very difficult to find music that links to uh, Fallout New Vegas. Oh, we, we could have done it without there, but we don't have a pair of 65. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't think we'll be able to level up with this. This uh, completing this quest. Mm, we may get close, which we could go on a hunting spree again. But... I think we might reach. No, we're not gonna. We're not even gonna reach halfway. Right, let's return to loyal. Um, we may get reach halfway with the actual thing, but we obviously didn't with uh, repairing them. But Jesus, we need to find something else that we can do. Um, to level up, because I do. I'm getting low frame rates here. I do need to um, get that thing done. Helios one done. That lucky old son. Because that lucky old son. Because last episode was called that lucky old son. We didn't even complete it. And if the, ne the next again episode, the episode after the episode called that lucky old son doesn't complete it, then that's just a bad example. Hello, loyal. Hello, outsider. Need something? Yes. I repaired that these solar arrays. Well, how about that? Turns out you aren't completely useless working with your hands. Could I get the code, uh, a code to use the VR pods in the mess hall? No, those aren't for outsiders to use. Leave them alone. I'm genuinely interested in your people's history. What are the pods for? Well, if you genuinely care so much, they're flight simulators. If you don't know our history yet, you should see Pete and get the tour. We dream to one day rule the skies. Okay, it's time for me to go. Later! See, that's is just getting... Uh, a thing way. Halfway. Do we still have... Oh, is that it? Oh, we must have come. Oh, do we have. I don't think we leveled up our medicine any further. What's our medicine at? Skills, medicine. 55. I don't think it's gonna. Don't think it's gonna cut it. Um. Oh well. It's a shame. But we could complete this quest and this could give us a big boost. Oh yeah, we've got the B 52 bomber. I think it's a B 52. There's a big bomber we need to do. Oh no. You have done well to earn the trust of my people, child. Well, I think I've done everything I can to help out. I believe the time has come for you to show your value in full. The people have come to accept having you around. Find Loyal and ask him about our people's fondest dream. He will tell you what to do next. All right. This is um, this is a, a very easy quest, but I don't think I'm gonna do it this episode. Um, 
I don't even know what's going to happen. Um, what's the timer at? Five minutes. Uh, I can always push it like I did last episode, but I don't want two episodes being super long. Pearl sent word saying it's all right to tell you about the lady in the water. Yep. That <laughs> sounds really creepy. <laughs> oh god. Lady in the water, what's that? A long time ago, long before the war that killed just about everything that ever lived, a bomber crashed not far from here. A bomber was a flying contraption that could drop explosives down on anything it flew not over. Not an idiot. But anyway, moving on. This bomber crashed down in Lake Mead, pretty damn near intact. When we got to Nellis, see, I found this article in a magazine all about it. There was another B-29 around oh, here, B29. part of a museum. Couldn't fly, but had a lot of spare parts, see? Get where I'm going? Since I was a young man, I've dreamed of raising that lady from the lake and bringing her back to life. What do you say? Where is it located? It's at the bottom of Lake Mead. I'll mark its location on your Pip-Boy map. And how do you expect me to raise the bomber from the bottom of the lake? I know, but you can tell me anyway for the audience's sake, loyal. Simple. Attach deployable ballast to the plane and float it on up. Here is a remote detonator. Once the ballast is attached to the plane, just hit the detonator from the shore and let buoyancy handle the rest. Okay, if it's so simple, why haven't you done it already? Maybe you don't understand. Hasn't been one of us, not a one, to set a foot outside Nellis in over 50 years. You come along with your knowledge of the outside, and it seems the time's come to raise the lady after all. Alright, I'm game. Let's Good. Here's the deployable ballast. Go find the plane, attach the ballast, and hit the button. Any ideas how we can get down to the bottom of Lake Mead without drowning? Might try holding your breath. If that doesn't sound good enough, talk to Jack. He was working on a rebreather once. Right. Yo, Jack. Rebreather. Things are getting stranger oh, I, every day. You're not Jack. Oh, there you are. Hiding. I'd never been so happy in my entire life. Good. Loyal said you could help me breathe underwater. I just need some parts from a pressure cooker to create a hermetic seal for the rebreather. Okay. I'll let you know when I can find a pressure cooker. Great. Right. Where am I going to get parts from a pressure cooker? <sighs> anyway. I think this is the B4 bomber. Part that uh, could kidney fly. The bomber that kidney fly. Looks like a fair lady. Anyway, I think it is time to say goodbye for today. Um, hope you had a good Christmas because this will be released uh, just after Christmas. And I hope you guys have a happy new year because new year will be upon us very, very soon. Um, I didn't really get much done today. As I wanted. We got the alien blaster, we got the alien alien weapons. Aliens, yes. Um but we didn't get everything done that we wanted. Caution, watch out. Watch your step. Huh? Um Anyway. Yeah, that's about Oh, it's just one. Oh. Anyway, um yeah. See you guys next time. My name is Stanley111. Make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you know that's already me. You are my audience and a great one at that. Keep on watching this series and I'll keep on producing the content that you guys want. Tell me in the comments if there's anything I need to change, anything at all. And um, I'll see you guys in the Nellis Air Force Base next year. Um, yeah, see ya.